Noah Grayson and Ross the same fight after the NASCAR Cup Series race at Kansas. We're going to talk about that. What's going on, guys? It's Daniel, and welcome back to our video. As I just said a second ago, Noah Gregson and Ross Hussein had a fight after the NASCAR Cup Series race at Kansas. Right after the inclusion of the NASCAR Cup Series race, Noah Gregson and Ross Hussein were having a very heated confrontation. Both were discussing the situation at the time. It was really, really calm. Then, Noah Gregson put his hands on Ross Hussein. Ross Hussein basically said, don't touch me. Don't grab me. And then after Noah kept grabbing on him and saying, what is your effing problem? Rosh Hussain hit him in the freaking head, squarely knocked him in the head. And there was a couple punches being thrown. There was official holding it back for things not to get worse. Then after he had Rosh Hussain basically laughing after the incident, after the confrontation happened. In my honest opinion... And Ross Chastain, well, yes, we know he's extremely aggressive, and sometimes I've been really critical of Ross Chastain in that situation. Noah was laying his hands on Ross Chastain quite a bit, and I think that's why Ross Chastain laid it. And Ross Chastain, I knew eventually was going to snap. Now, Ross Chastain's probably had this coming where people were going to confront him, and he almost got into a fight a couple years ago with Kyle Busch in 2021 in Phoenix, and Ross Chastain's had a lot of drivers having frustration with him. Look, even earlier in the race, Kyle Busch, he got frustrated with Ross Chastain in the race as well. Now, now, where did the situation happen between Noah Grayson and Ross Chastain? Well, I think it was in stage number two, if I'm not mistaken. Ross Chastain and Noah Grayson were battling. And I think there was some contact between Ross Chastain and Noah Grayson, where Noah Grayson got into the wall after the contact of Ross Chastain. Then Noah tried to retaliate against Ross Chastain coming down the straightaway and got into him a couple times, and I thought there was going to be a wreck because of that. And it's a shame, too, because Noah Grayson was having a fantastic run. After that, Noah Grayson ended up spinning out and lost a shot. And a really, really good run. Again, we know how aggressive Ross Chastain is. And eventually, like I said, there was going to be some time where someone was going to confront Ross Chastain in this situation. That being said, I really do like Ross Chastain a lot. And Ross Chastain's personality is something that I love. He doesn't really, he leaves it out on the track. And both Ross Chastain and Noah Grayson both lead it out on the track. They're both kind of similar with their driving style. <laughs> they race super aggressive, and they're going to race as aggressive as possible. And it's been coming. He's had, like I said, a lot of confrontations Ross Chastain has had this year. So it's not really a big shock or surprise that this ended up happening. It's just to see Ross Chastain finally snap and get in a fight with Noah Grayson is absolutely wild. My question is going to be, is there going to be any penalties or actions taken because of the situation? Personally, I hope there's no penalties. And no actions taken from this situation because I don't want to see NASCAR penalize both drivers. I want these fights to happen. And I really hope that NASCAR does not end up penalizing both of the drivers. We need fights in this sport. It creates a lot of headlines and creates a lot of storylines. And I hope that we don't get any penalties from this. But I don't know, just, it was absolutely wild to see. But we go back into the history of Ross Chassin. He's had a lot of drivers he's made mad in the last year or two. Drivers like Chris Rebell. Chase Sellian, Denny Hamlin. Remember, Denny Hamlin Chan and uh, Ross Chastain have had a history throughout the last year or two. We've seen Eric Jones get frustrated. Alex Bowman get frustrated this year. Kyle Busch earlier today got frustrated, and he's been frustrated multiple times to go back to Circuit of the Americas. It was inevitably going to happen at some point. There was going to be a fight for Ross Chastain, and it did end up happening for him. But to see Ross Chastain laid it down was absolutely wild and absolutely crazy. But just insane stuff happening after the NASCAR Cup Series race. It's like a short track style fight that ended up happening on a mile and a half track. Absolutely wild and absolutely crazy stuff happening after the NASCAR Cup Series race at Kansas. So that is going to be today's special NASCAR video. I want to thank you guys for watching. Please like, subscribe to the channel. Notifications on so if I win a video, it does go live on my channel. <coughs> Follow me on Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram, and support me on Patreon as well. Link description below for that, and comment your thoughts below on today's video. What are thoughts about the fight between Noah Grayson and Ross the Saint, and who you think was in the right, and who you think was in the wrong? Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Tomorrow on the channel, we're going to probably discuss a little more on this, and we'll also talk about some other news that's come out over the last couple of days. Then also later in the day, we'll have the Truck Series race picks for Darlington. Then on Tuesday, we're going to have the Xfinity Series race picks from Darlington, and have some other content on the channel that I think you're going to enjoy. Then on Wednesday, we're going to basically have a NASCAR news video on the channel discussing news from the last few days and probably any other special announcements do, do come out over the next couple of days. A lot of content on the way, and thank you all for the support recently. I greatly appreciate it. And also go check out the cup race review that went up just recently. So anyways, like I said, I want to thank you for watching today's special report, and I'll see you guys next time for more great awesome NASCAR content and other motorsports content on the channel like this. Take care, everybody.